to the millions of Canadians that are still up, that I'm meeting tonight for the first time, good morning. I'm Aaron O'Toole. That introduction some 13 months ago, kicking off Aaron O'Toole's reign as a leader of the Conservative Party of Canada. Flash forward to this moment. We are live at his election night headquarters, federal election night headquarters in Oshawa. Now that his name is more familiar and his race to become PM is down to the wire, just how did he get here? I believe that Canada's best days are on the horizon. The man who would become a contender for Ottawa's top job was born in Montreal in 1973. Growing up east of Toronto in Bowmanville, politics would become part of the family. His dad, John O'Toole, worked for General Motors before serving for nearly two decades as Durham, Ontario's progressive conservative MPP. As for Aaron O'Toole, a little campaign theme song there, his journey to elected office saw him attend Kingston's Royal Military College, launching his decorated military career in the Royal Canadian Air Force. He'd go on to study law at Dalhousie University in Halifax before a stretch in the private sector as a corporate lawyer in Ontario, where he now lives with his two kids, Molly and Jack, and wife of more than 20 years, Rebecca. A little tidbit from O'Toole's website. This 80s hit played during the couple's first wedding dance. In 2012, the family celebrated O'Toole's first political victory, elected as MP for Durham, a riding he has continued to represent. He'd briefly serve as Veterans Affairs Minister, and in 2017, he ran for the Conservative Party's leadership, only to lose out, finishing third to winner Andrew Scheer. But in 2020, O'Toole gave it another go, this time winning the Conservative leadership race. My fellow Canadians, my name is Aaron O'Toole. I believe in this country, and I'm running to serve you as Prime Minister. Will Canadians give O'Toole a new reason to celebrate after the votes are counted?